and welcome back to my second channel. So I mentioned this in a previous video, but I wanted to know if you guys I uh, wanted to see like a wish list video, what I'm asking for for Christmas. I love watching these videos because it gives me ideas of not only what to add to like my wish list or what I want to buy myself like during the Boxing Day sales, but also for gift ideas for other people. If you see something you like that you're like, oh my gosh, that would be perfect for a friend, you know? So I wanted to go through that. Um, with you guys as well as i'll talk about like some gifts that i got for other family members too if you're curious for that this is the busiest time of year for me because on my asmr channel i do 12 days of role plays kind of like i guess vlogmas but asmr style so i have to pre-film all of those videos uh, there's no way i could do vlogmas on this channel i think i would go insane from the amount of filming i have to do 12 days of role plays there and then i also have this channel that i like to do a couple little videos for now and then obviously my clothing line black friday sales packing all of those up and then still university it's the busiest time with school and finishing up assignments plus i have a photo shoot coming up for my clothing line it is just so hectic right now so if you guys are feeling stressed out and holiday school stress, I am right there with you. We are stressed out together. You know what can make us feel a bit better? Some retail therapy. So let's look at some cute items. So I will put pictures on the screen. Of course, I'll move over a little bit so they can pop up here. But the first thing that I asked for is the most expensive item. And I've wanted this for a really, really long time. So it is the solid gold ombre birthstone ring from local eclectic i love local eclectic they're like an ethical jewelry brand and they carry a ton of niche designers and stuff they're super gorgeous their pieces are amazing um i even mentioned them in my jewelry favorites video but they are really expensive so the ring i'll also tell you prices um the ring is 305 dollars. i know so that is like my big Christmas present that I'm asking for um, instead of like, you know, I feel like the classic thing that people do growing up is like they ask for electronics or something. So I'm asking for a ring. It's so expensive, but it's so pretty. And next up, I'm starting off with kind of the most expensive items. I wanted this pink and blue beach bag I saw on someone's Instagram and it was so adorable. I was going to buy it for myself. But then it was sold out and at this point i had only had like two things on my christmas wish list and my family was like okay you need to add some more to it because we don't know what to get you instead i'm picking this one and adding it to the list it is yellow and baby blue i'm just looking at everything here and it is so a freaking adorable i love it i've never been to saint barth <laughs> Never, but maybe I should because the bags are adorable. I know a lot of people do all inclusives or Mexico, but I've never, I've never been. So this is my first step into being somewhere warm. <laughs> but the next thing is these makeup brushes that are seventy eight dollars USD, um, and you get, I think you get a lot of them. So they're cruelty free and vegan, and you get fifteen brushes. So they are baby pink and they have little gems on them. They're so gorgeous. Um, if you guys are from my ASMR channel, you know I loved my blend brushes. Like I love them, don't get me wrong. But I also just needed some more makeup brushes because going back and forth from my like house with my family to my place in Kingston, I just don't want to carry like all my makeup stuff every time. So I kind of want a set that I can leave there. Gift idea for anyone in your family, like who wears makeup, of course, or is getting into makeup because quality makeup brushes make the world of a difference when applying makeup. Okay, now I also asked just for some kind of more random items for stocking stuffers. So I asked for Crest White Strips. <laughs> That's what I use to whiten my teeth. If you guys are wondering, I do get some questions on what I use. So I asked for those. I also asked for some like Gillette Fusion razors, like some refills. I also asked for an AirPod cleaning kit. I've seen them on Amazon. I've seen them, I think like Grace V used one when she was cleaning her AirPods in an ASMR video a long time ago. 
but I really wanted one. My AirPods don't get too dirty, but I wanted one not only to just have to keep them clean, but for a video, I thought that that would be good. Last but not least on my list, I added two makeup products, makeup slash skincare. So I've been seeing these everywhere on TikTok, so I really wanted to try them. They are the Drunk Elephant um, De-Bronzy Anti-Pollution Bronzing Drops with Peptides. People have been raving about this, and I think I've talked about this on here before, but I have been looking for like a liquid cream bronzer that I actually like. I'm so picky with my cream bronzers. Like, I'm not even wearing any bronzer now because I'm so picky with how it is on my skin. These have really good reviews. Everyone's raving about them. So I wanna try them out. If you have these, um, let me know in the comment section if you like them, they're worth it. But currently they are on my list. And then the second thing is the Drunk Elephant O Blues Rosy Glow Drops. These have a little bit less good reviews, but I think it's because people are like, it's more of just a liquid blush rather than skincare but I'm just in it more for the liquid blush. I kind of think it's gonna be like a Charlotte Tilbury highlight, um, the Beauty Wand blush dupe, and you get way more product in these. So currently on my list, just as a quick run through, I have the ring, I have the peach bag, which I can't believe it sold out because I saw it yesterday and it had just been added and now it's sold out. So after have to replace that. Um, I also asked for another thing that sold out, but it was like this car jumper kit. So if you ever needed to jump your car, it was also sold out. Um, but I asked for the makeup brushes and Crest White Strips, Gelat Fusion, AirPod cleaning kit, and some Drunk Elephant items. Now, in terms of what I got my family members, my mom, I got her a bunch of stuff from winners like I just did a ton of stuff. I got her some clothes, I got her makeup, I got her skincare, and then I got her some books and journaling stuff, some like um, mental health like books just for keeping like a positive attitude and stuff because she's been really into all that like manifesting, positivity, positive energy, like you know reducing anxiety, all that type of stuff. This folding mat off of Amazon, so I'll include a picture of that because she always likes to like, I guess kind of meditate. Um, and I don't know, it's also good for yoga. I think the mat, if you wanted to do some really light stretches. And then for my grandma, cause I'm going to BC for Christmas to visit my dad and my grandma. So because I'm going there, I get my grandma like actual tangible gifts. Whereas for my other grandparents who live far away, I get them gift cards and money or like certificates to go to the spa or something in their area. But since I'm going and seeing my grandma, I get her, you know, actual like gifts. So I got her this rug making kit. Thought that that was a fun activity. My neighbors also just got home. So I'm sorry if it gets loud, I'll try and speed this up. I got a rug cooking kit. I got her this gardening thing. So she loves gardening in the summer. So it's like a little seat so she can sit and garden comfortably. And it also flips over so it can be a kneeling pad for when you're gardening so her knees don't get sore. I thought that, that was so thoughtful. I'm really proud of that one. Um, I also got her some skincare and stuff for her stockings, some makeup, hair care items. Got her a like neck shoulder heating pad that just kind of like sits around your neck. Um, she has a lot of shoulder problems, so I thought that that would be relaxing for her. And then I got her one of those ice cube, like you fill it with ice and then you can deep puff your face. I'll put a picture on the screen, of course, so you guys can see better, but it's supposed to be like for deep puffing and skincare. I think she's going to love it. And then last but not least for her, I got her a grandmother's journal, memories and keepsakes for my grandchild. So she is really into like scrapbooking and all of that type of stuff. My other grandparents aren't into it as much as her. So this is like a journal that she can write down like her favorite memories, all of her favorite things. And then I get to keep it um, as like a keepsake for her. So and lastly, we have my dad. So I am going to be to see my dad, as I mentioned. So when I'm there and I can like 
obviously give the gifts i can do a bit more because i can ship everything to the house and some golf balls titleist pro v1 if you're a golfer you know those are expensive but apparently they're the best um i got him this like multi-tool pen which is supposed to be pretty cool it has some good reviews i think it's like it's like a stocking stuffer but i don't know it's a nine in one pen i think it's good for like tools and i don't know knickknacks stuff he's an electrician so i think he'll like it <laughs> And then I got him a three-in-one magnetic foldable wireless charger for his phone and his Apple Watch. I don't think he has AirPods, but still he can use it for his phone and Apple Watch. He also travels a lot. He is always flying. So I thought that the portable charger would be great. Along with, I got him an AirFly Pro, which is a wireless transmitter. So that when you're on the flights, and you have to like plug in your headphones, you know? You don't have to have the long cord and it's like annoying with, you know, your tray and people wanting to go to the washroom and you have to unplug your headphones and there's cords everywhere. This is, you plug it in and it's like a Bluetooth little system. You'll see a picture and then it connects to your headphones, like your AirPods or your other Bluetooth headphones. He has other Bluetooth headphones, so it'll be perfect. And then you don't have to deal with the cords or anything. So. I am so happy that I found that. I think he's gonna love it. I think it's so neat. And last but not least for him, I got him an expandable travel laptop backpack. So he normally doesn't travel with a ton of luggage. He just likes a carry-on. And my dad will literally use like a grocery bag for his carry-on, a grocery bag, like a reusable grocery bag. Don't get me wrong, it's adorable, but I think we can make it a little bit nicer. So I got him, yeah, this, it's like a backpack that can expand to three different sizes. So it still fits and is classified as a carry-on, but when he doesn't have a lot of stuff and just needs a grocery bag sized thing, he can shrink it down. So I'm really excited for those um, travel items. I think he's really gonna, gonna love them. If you guys have any cool items that, I don't know, you think, you think are neat, then leave them in the comments and I can check them out and add them to my wanna buy list for boxing day but yeah i love you all so much i hope you enjoyed this requested video and i will see you guys in the next one